angry and desperate. Lebanese protesters are back on the streets. Violence has rocked parts of the country since the start of the week, with demonstrators defying coronavirus lockdown orders and clashing with security forces. The situation has been particularly violent in the northern city of Tripoli. Banks have been set ablaze and ATMs smashed as people vented their anger at having their deposits frozen. The country is struggling with currency shortages following years of over-reliance on foreign funds and controversial monetary policy. Since last October, the Lebanese pound has lost more than half its value. In March, Lebanon defaulted on its foreign debt for the first time in its history as the government failed to repay more than 1 billion euros of bond. The national debt amounts to about 170% of GDP, with half the government spending going to repaying it. The coronavirus pandemic has slowed the economy even further. The unemployment rate is about 40 percent, with six out of ten young people out of work.